place right now. We're in Santa Monica at my Avis. <laughs> And we're passing, you know, Louis Vuitton, uh, Coach, you know, all of those stores that we like, Prada. So, you know, we're just browsing and perusing in this lovely, lovely outdoor indoor mall, <laughs> the Promenade. This is nice. This is nice. There's Nordstrom, Bloomingdale's, you know, all of the stores that we like. So, I feel like I'm at home. <laughs> the first uh, online peer-to-peer -peer sharing platform, uh, illegal, and then he was the first president of Facebook. He stepped down earlier last year because of this privacy scandal. He's the founder, of course, is Mark Zuckerberg, but he was the first president of Facebook. This house is owned by Pub Daddy. We saw him twice last summer coming out with his personal trainer for a morning walk on the public road. Okay. He doesn't like to be bothered, so we didn't. We oh. just waved at him. Okay. I don't, he, he didn't go. So. so he has two uh, limos. He's got the Maybach Mercedes. To, uh, silver and dark brown. He's got a beige SUV, and this is somebody of his gang. TV, Michael Jackson. Mm. And this is the house. If you open the the gate, we're here now. Mm -hmm. See the chimney, and that's it. Now a, a investment banker lives there. It's sold to him, so oh, it's not rent for rent. He paid a hundred thousand dollars for it a month. Oh, chop change. <laughs> okay. Uh, party catering truck. You know, during the weekend there's all kinds of events here, especially around the holidays. It would be nice to be on the guest list for Thanksgiving. Right. <laughs> for Thanksgiving. Side uh, entrance for servants, and, and if you look up, for those sitting on the right, you see the balcony, of the bedroom where he was found. Oh wow! Yeah, right there. Oh so, yeah. Okay. Now. Michael was the king of pop. pop. <laughs> Here we are. So we came around. Yeah. That's where he is. King of pop. Now, who was his idol? Um, in the music. Um, I would say that too. <laughs> but it was he married his daughter. Elvis. Yes, Elvis. <laughs> and Elvis was the king of rock and roll. Yeah. Okay. So yes, and I'm he good. lived down the street. Hold on, I'm not And uh, that, of course, he also had a. His house where he's buried in Memphis, Tennessee, where yeah. he has Graceland. Yeah, Graceland. Have you been? No, but yeah, I've no. heard. You're, you're looking at the um, one of the interior shots of the oh. the house. Yeah. And then we have Elvis Presley. We're here, Monoville Drive. Mm -hmm. Michael Jackson, Elvis Presley. You're looking at the white wall of the tennis court. If you go up the stairs, you go up to the canopy and then the main main residence, and then you just pass the gate okay. to the driveway. Yeah. All right, Elvis Presley. You also yes. had an estate in Bel Air, up in the hills. 67. And also, uh, this area of Beverly Hills happens to have no fences to hide the, the mansions behind. You can admire the front lawn, the, the, the house itself. And uh, yeah, landscapers and gardeners do pretty well here. 1914 was the year that Beverly Hills got incorporated as a city. And uh, the people that were investing here we're hoping to find oil but they found water. We have a lot of management uh, offices for entertainment and the attorneys that service the uh, entertainment industry. Over the year was uh, actor Charlie Chaplin, Douglas Fairbanks and over the years you got Lucille Ball, Dean Martin and all the big names had property here one way or another and also up in Bel Air and some in Beholby Hills. And uh, El Pacino still lives around here. Yeah, award season starting end of October through February. So there's always something happening here or some other hotel. Yeah. So, that's the Foreign Press Award going on. Now, there are more streets like this here in Beverly Hills, but this just happens to be one of the most famous. So sometimes you have paparazzis here, and when you spot them, you know something's about to happen because they got tipped that somebody would be shopping here. Mm -hmm. This is the son of Dijon. But the original one is on the left, the Mansour store. Oh. See where the Bentley SUV yeah. is parked? They usually <laughs> park their rolls there. It has their own parking meter, yellow. <laughs> wow. That's a, a Officers for plastic surgery. 
Oh, oh. There. If you yeah. need a nip and tuck, they have a special Nippin'? these week. Two more guys in one. Oh, So this, uh, this is Sunset Plaza, and this is where you'll find some nice restaurants where people stand in line in the weekends, like on the cross street with the blue parasols, and, uh, good brunches and breakfast. The Petit Four on the right is where I saw a couple of actors, one of which was Colombo, Mr. Peter Falk when he was still Petit alive. Four, yeah. Sometimes they park their exclusive cars in there. Exotic cars out in front. <laughs> uh, the Wahlburgers across the street on your left. Mark Wahlberg and his brothers are on the chain. They opened up here. Sometimes he pops in and helps out. Very down to earth guy. Nell's Diner, drive in 24 7. Very nice. Not from Happy Days, but there's two more. <laughs> Just coincidental. Yeah, ironically, this place comes to life after sunset. Everything <laughs> lights up, yeah. In 89, they decided to leave the letters L A N D off, officially. Wow. It has been in Hollywood for a while. And uh, you wouldn't say so, but if you can picture a four-story apartment building, that's how tall those letters are. playing wish okay maybe I she's, wish. A, she's a fairy i wish for a baby doll where's the baby doll i wish for a baby doll okay you gonna grant it you gonna grant my wish okay let me close my eyes stay close <laughs> you want you want yeah a baby doll you want close your eyes 
You got it. She wished the baby doll. She wished the baby doll. Where's the baby doll? Baby doll. Wish. She wished the baby doll. You wished the baby doll. I did. I wished the baby doll. <laughs> oh, here it is. Did you just magically make this appear, Dallas? <laughs> First day, I love LA. We about to do this. A Lord charm. I'm excited. Got my coffee with espresso this morning. And he's buried here at this Reagan Library in Simi Valley with his wife, Nancy. She was also an actress. She, she was on the contract at MGM in the late 40s. Hollywood Bowl Amphitheater. It's right here. Oh. You like the sand? You're not sinking in as far as me at all. <laughs> she gone. This is my day, but yeah. I made it to the beach. Yeah. Same with St. Castle. Yeah, I know it. Water. It's windy. Okay. <laughs> it's windy. Make a star.